Hi, welcome to my video, which is part of a series of videos. And in this video in particular, it's really all about how to um, retrieve data and how to create new thinking, especially whenever you are attempting and you're going to regulate your own chemistry. So in one of the earlier videos, what I've posted is really how we can regulate our own chemistry. We've all been that person who's been in a room or heard news or information or seen something and it's really knocked us off center and our energy feels suddenly very, very different and we would like to get back on track. Okay, so regulating our own chemistry. As humans in the coaching diploma, which I have studied, which is coaching and neuroscience, we know that um, people are open looped social engagement systems so that your chemistry affects my chemistry. So everyone that you live in a, in a home environment or everyone in your work environment or everyone in your community, we were all affecting one another and uh, we're all responsible for our own chemistry. OK, so this is one of um, a top, this is kind of like a tip or a guideline on how you can regulate your own chemistry. Hi, I'm Sandra Nelson. I'm a life coach. I'm a Reiki master. I'm also an intuitive reader. All my services are provided online and I work with people around the world. If you like this video, please like, share and comment. And also please subscribe. There's a reminder above and there's a little button below. Um, there's also a notification button where you can get notified for my Tuesday videos. So how to basically create new thinking and how to retrieve data. So one of the ways, the easiest ways to retrieve data is to ask really good questions and to really go into your thinking, okay? And so retrieving data and creating new thinking is to be able to have a couple of questions that just pop into your head and that it can actually help you steer your thinking in a particular direction. So one of the questions which I find quite helpful for me uh, whenever I'm faced with something that's really difficult um, or something which is just a, a it's just a minor hiccup. I will always say to myself, no, has this ever happened to anyone else before in the world? And generally that just dissipates any kind of tension or anxiety that I have. And I realized, yeah, of course, this has happened to other people before in the world, especially whenever you're putting yourself um, under a lot of pressure to perform or to do a really good job or to stay really calm whenever you're really tired. And there's lots of things that have been challenge you, challenging you in your life up until this point. So knowing your own thinking and being able to retrieve data and create new thinking is really important. And we do that through questions. Ask yourself a whole bunch of questions um, which will really help trigger new thinking. And that will take your chemistry from where you've just gone to and it'll help you regulate your chemistry back in, especially if you're practicing the other previous tips which I've mentioned, which is that you set up a contract with yourself daily. You know what's ahead of you in the day as best you can. You prepare yourself as best you can. You agree that you're going to have fun, gratitude, joy, live authentically, have really good communication with people. You know your values, uh, you know what you're operating from in terms of what brings value and meaning to your life. And then basically by retrieving data and you thinking it's like that ability to ask yourself meaningful questions, which really help you in that moment. You can help yourself. Sometimes we always look for help externally, but really we have everything inside of us and we have powerful, powerful thoughts and powerful energy fields and way of being. Uh, which can really trigger a, you know, us to move into a much better space and regulate our chemistry. So I hope that this has helped you as a tip and I hope there's been enough understanding in this explanation of how to bring in uh, new thinking and how to retrieve data. We retrieve data by asking ourselves really good questions. So thank you so much. I'm Sandra Nelson Haling. Please don't forget to subscribe check the link below and also comment, like and share my video. Thank you so much. Bye for now.